So this is a video on how to record in Wii Video. So obviously first thing you need to do is open Wii Video and once you do this is the first screen that you should see. Since we're going to create a new video we're going to click on create new video. Um, this video will be a project not a video edit because we're going to start from scratch. So we're going to click on project and hit next. Now this title, this is just for you. You could name this anything you want to. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and do Wii Video Test. But this is not what your teacher will see, so it doesn't really matter what you call this as long as it makes sense to you. Uh, if you are working personally, you'll want to do a personal one. If many people are going to be working on this project, we'll do collaborative or you can even share. But today we're just going to focus on personal. So click on personal and then next. From this screen, I don't need any of my other strange things that are in here. So I'm just going to hit next again. And now it tells me I'm done. It's ready to create a video. So let's create a video. From here, you can see all my wacky stuff, but I don't want any of these things here. Instead, I want something brand new. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on that red button right there, which means record. So I'm gonna record and then you're gonna get two options. Do I wanna record my screen or the webcam? I would very much like webcam. And you should see my face here in just a moment. Hi, there I am. So here, you wanna make sure record audio is on. If it's not on, you won't hear anything. Uh, you're going to want to choose your microphone. For the most part, you're probably going to want to click on default or built-in microphone, uh, especially for your Chromebooks. Built-in microphone works fine, which is also the default, so it doesn't matter. Uh, in my case, I'm using this microphone here, so I'm going to click on that, and then I'll hit record and wait for my countdown. Hi, I'm now recording in Wii Video. This is just a test. It is only a test. Don't worry. Just a test. Look at that awesome face right there. So from here, I can preview my recording if I'd like. I am now recording in Wii Video. This is happy with my recording. I can hit save. I could also record a new one right here if I wanted to. So I'm going to hit save. And you can see that it's rendering right here. And once it's done rendering, we'll go on now done rendering. Step. So the next step is quite simple. All I'm going to do is drag this new video into where it says drop videos or images here. Now I have my video and they've already supplied me with a title screen. Now most of the time we don't need the title, but if we do want that title, we can click on edit and just change that title to whatever we would like. For instance, we video test. Click on done editing, and now I have that. So now I can preview my entire video with title screen. And there's my Wii video test. I am now recording in Wii video. This is just a test. It is only. So if I'm happy with this, I can move on to the next step. But I did want to show you before I leave here, just in case you came to this screen. It may have looked a little different. There's this timeline mode here. Now in timeline mode, I can do a whole lot more things, but right now we're not interested in that. So I just want to make sure that if you did come into here originally, you can just click on this button here, click over to storyboard mode. Don't worry about this guy here. And I'm back in the storyboard mode, which is just a whole lot easier. So once I'm finished, I'm going to click on finish because I want to actually create my video. So I'm going to click finish. Now this is where the title will go that your teacher will see. So in this case, you would want to make sure that this is the appropriate title you want for your teacher. If you're happy with your original title, just go with that again. So I'm again going to go with We Video Test. And I'm going to click set. Now it brings you to the screen. Two things you need to do here. You need to click on 480p. Do not worry about going up higher because all it's going to do is take more room and it's unneeded. But do link this to your Google Drive. So in order to do that, you're going to click on the Google Drive button and then hit finish. This will bring us to a queuing station. And once your video is queued up, it will start to process. As it processes, you will see 
a the, green line you know, go across here and eventually it will fill up and as soon as it's done we will move on to the next step once your video is done rendering it'll bring you to this screen where you can play your video if you'd like to to double check that it's exactly what you thought it was going to be once you I am now recording in we yes this is exactly what I needed I come down here this is the Google Classroom icon it's this little green box right here so I'm gonna click on that that's gonna bring me to this screen where it's gonna ask me to choose the class that I'm in that I want to turn this assignment into and then a prompt will come up for the choose assignment so I'm gonna choose assignment and the assignment was called Wii Video, so that's the one I'm going to click on. Now I'm going to hit Go. Now this has given me a link because I wasn't able to attach this to my Google Drive. So if that does happen or you simply forgot to push the button for Google Drive, it'll give you this link, but you can still attach this to the assignment. So I hit Attach. I can view that assignment if I want to in Classroom. So I go back. And if I'm all done turning in, and if I'm all done, and if I've put everything on this assignment that I would like, I'm going to now hit the turn in button. And it says I have my attachment. And again, I go ahead and I hit turn in. And now I have turned in that assignment. So congratulations, you've completed your first Google assignment using Wii Video.